Oh, so I'm watching an amazing movie today on TCM, Little Women. And Little Women, if you know the movie Thank Little Women, you. but it's all of that. And how many characters do you see yourself in? Excuse me. Coffee Burke. I said, excuse me. So I sat though, by the way. By the way, Val is woke. It's a Sunday and I feel good, by the way. Yep. And I like Joe who wanted to write a book and didn't want to get married. Okay. Like I have been the person that I really was never like, I didn't grow up like, I got to have me a husband. I got to have me. A, that, that, that was not me in my way. Now listen, my dad and my mom to each other married late, but they had things to do, you know, so you really want to make sure. We got problems today. We'll just take you to the workroom, okay? Because this is going to be a short one. And she goes through the halls. She goes through the halls. Just like, you know, you're going through a sorority and fraternity. And you go through, the, you know, the halls. And, the, you know, and you have the candles. I don't have the candles, but I got my coffee. Woo, child. People could have been real friends. I could have been a real friend to some of these people. But some of these people didn't know what they see. And then they brought out their jealousy. And I don't know what. I don't. I honestly don't know what the deal is that New York thinks they have on me. But you know what? And everybody will always say, well, you act like you from New York or you I'm I, like from a lot of places okay <laughs> I'm a military brat we are like you know we're everywhere and nowhere all at the same time but you know what it's so sad that we, these people be lying oh my god I didn't know she would go and work, wake up doing uh, poetic justice today but that's okay that's just my way because my mommy and daddy said I have something to say it's the morning Virgo today I think it might be oh it's the coffee no no ho oh, it's me Mm. Speaking of which, where's Ho today? And it's that, see? You know what? Here's the deal. I have learned. What happens when the stereotypes are real? Pause. Let me say something. If I have the vision, if I have the sight, would not actually see in reality what's wrong and what's right. No, I'm the crazy one. I'm the crazy one. You got the hoes that are being the, pro the prototype. You got the thugs that are being the prototype. So God is going to save all the hoes and all the thugs. And that's the world that you like. Really? What can a hoe or a thug do? End up going to jail or to hell and take you with it. Oh, wow. You, you chose that. You chose the stuff that wasn't real. Notice how all these so-called hoes or thugs or whatever they be, they're overseas trying to find a deal. What kind of deal are you going to find? You know what? And a lot of people say, we're going to bring America down, okay? But you live in America. I am tapping again. Like you, But you live in America. So what are you going to do when the bombs come down on you? Like all of a sudden, you think your hoe going to lift you up in a month? Like Elon, Elon Musk going to bring the Tesla, the Tesla spaceship and lift you up? Oh, it's that too. So like, was that true? That story true that JC literally held, you know, Rihanna over a window and said, you know what? You can either sign this contract. You know, or, or, or you can, you can go down. You're not going down the elevator. You can go out, out the window like that. Okay. That's why I don't go in these rooms. Okay. That's why I don't go in some houses. Okay. That's when I see what gang you people. I have been around some gang members that did not know that you were trying to play a gang on me. And even they said, God, she must have got around her in her. I do see. I was telling you the truth for the whole time, but you were trying to lie. And like I said, I don't have any, um, cartel or gang ties but at the same time i'm a little purple girl i'm a little blue i'm a little red i'm a little whatever i need to be in this world and is that who is she i'm not you i don't wake up drinking and smoking and snorting and effing on somebody else's boo i don't need you 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 especially if you are lying to me in my face and you think i want to erase you i love it when these planes and helicopters fly over me because i have a tendency to have a little bit of ptsd see i was around my mother and my father when they really tried to lift up the community and i saw how they turned on the real people who are real royalty bitch don't play with me today the day is not the day. It's Sagittarius season. Thank God. Mommy's in control, by the way. Yes, my mother. My mother's not your mother. Why? Because my mama didn't raise no hoe. Pause. They say people, they say, they say people are just like their mothers and their fathers, yo. I'm like both. Have you met my mother and my father in real life? Have you met me in real life or just, what you call it? The standby. The one who was pretending. I've had so many people that say, your sister came through. Actually, in reality, I have no sisters. And that includes my sorority, too. I mean, I'm just saying, like, if you were really a sorority to me, then when I was going through all this drama and all this trying stuff, where were you helping me? Didn't I help you? 
Didn't I help you cross over? Didn't I bring joy? Didn't I bring? I remember that time when Miss Thompson said, there are those who are just born to work. And that stuck in my head. Is it because of my color or because of my brilliance? Or it's just, I'm that resilient and brilliant. And it might be because of my color, too, because people think darky people are supposed to always do the do for you. Like if you are a lighter hue. You know what my grandma, my mama, my mama, who was that hue, and my grandpa, papa, papa said, we don't F with you. You know, some 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 black people own slaves, too. And I don't know if some of my, and I don't know if some of my people on that side, I, I, I actually don't know. But if you look at Pete and Boz, you know, you do <laughs> So I heard, <laughs> I don't know if it's true, <laughs> but grandma, mama, 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 mama said that's part of my energy and DNA coming through. So if those people are a part of my family tree, you have effed up with the wrong one. Whoa, you got my ties, so do I. You got my fear ties, so do I. <laughs> Take your toy and stories. Bet you won't go outside in your little box. Oh, I need to teach that woman. You need to teach me what? I have seen people just junk up their whole house and junk up everything and just be drunk all over the place while the woman has to pick up for them, okay? Listen, I'm not that. See how you treat your women? Then that's how you would treat me. You honestly really think that I'm going to come into your energy? I'll kill you all. <laughs> I swear to God. Pow! I told you I know the difference between defenders and gold eyes. Ooh, go ahead and send the police after me. Go ahead. Go ahead. Send everybody after me. Like you think I haven't been vetted already by the FBD, the CIA, the FBI, and the military. Of course I have. I mean, wouldn't it make sense to you? Who do you think is helping me running the show? I got me smiling the way I do. They know. They know. She knows. He knows, we know, and we know about you. Ooh, federal crimes. <laughs> <laughs> the feds say, no, no, but I didn't say that. I'm like, by the way, there was an article uh, of the most sinful cities in the USA. You know, fans, what's on it? Oh, my God. I'm going to have to go walk in today. I'm going to go outside. What are you going to do? I know even my military people are like, like, can you, like, come out here? Like, we could, we could, we're, like, we're all out here. But I know, but I like Carver's Creek. I really do. And, like, you like, you don't, like, you don't come out there, too. <laughs> if you don't have me, I know you do. At Fort Bird, but trust me, the ghosts got me. Yeah. There are no such thing as ghosts. Okay. I've had people come to my house and and, and and I bet you they changed the way they thought, okay? Show house haunted? Yeah. But they, but I say that and they think I'm kidding. Or well, she's crazy. Why where are you at, Quan Sedine? Where are you at, Q Queena? <laughs> where about those papers you wanted me to sign about? What happened to that water? Everybody was pushing water. Everybody was pushing water. What happened to all that water but people was pushing? Was that water just was that some water we can trust? You know what? That's why I don't deal with a whole bunch of water signs. I don't deal with a whole bunch of Scorpios and Cancers, because a lot of them be lying. Now, I mean, you know what? You can put that on every sign on the block and all zodiac signs. No, some people don't do zodiac signs. I don't know what some people do. People talk about, you know, they talk about Jesus, but Jesus don't know you. First off, there were no J's in that name, so the actual name would not have been Jesus, okay? That story is actually true. Speaking Aramaically, but you don't want to speak about that. Why? Is it because you're on the T2? You're stuck in your loop? Okay, then I'm going to let you go at that. Go ahead. I'm just saying, if you don't want a real conversation, I have had lots of Jehovah Witnesses come and knock on me. Because you know me, but now I don't do that anymore. But I just opened up my doors. Who wants to talk? But I don't do that as before because my mom and my dad said, you be open up your doors. So too many people. And we, okay, now mom is coming in. Like, would I talk to these people? No, you would not. Thank you. 
Stop acting like your pop. Want to engage in a conversation with everybody and try to help these people when they can't help themselves. See, these are the people who will pull on your health and your wealth. These are people who will literally set you up. Did I hear somebody send a Leviathan after me? Guess what? Your time is up. You may get all your little Simpson stands. You can get all the Kardashians and the Will Smith and the music industry and the political industry and the crazy preaching industry. You can get the Hillsong people and all those and create them in your own little voodoo, hoodoo, voodoo, Leviathan type of thing. But you know what? There's a bigger dragon up in the sky. You know what I mean? Oh, checkmate. My Leviathan against your Leviathan. I bet you my dragon will win. It's the year of the dragon. Is it the year of the dragon? I don't know. She is sweating. I got to go outside. It's hot in here. And man, am I the only one? I need to go back and watch a little. There's so many real stars in, 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 in Little Women too. So many real stars, real actresses, real stuff. The people, the way that they act, the, the just the, the talent back in the day. I was talking to somebody at, at Wally Wheeler at, at Walmart. Uh, Stand the History Man. Lord. But you know, you people don't know real radio, by the way. Like I, I have no, I have absolutely no, uh, as far as being in radio to that degree, I'm right where I need to be. I don't give a damn about who's on Foxy 99, who's on Magic, who's on, I take, I've taken all these people's jobs. <laughs> That's in reality. I took your job, your job, your, and I did the job and I didn't suck the D. And you're right, sir. Cumulus is just effed up. I mean, there's a lot of stuff that's effed up. But hey, I tried to tell you that me and Mitch Faulkner in the Edge magazine, we told you that a long time ago in what, the eight, the 90s? You know what I mean? But you know what? This is what I know. You can't tell dumb people, <laughs> people who are arrogant. You can't tell narcissists anything. You can't, even when you show it to them, you can say the sky is blue. And they say, no, the sky is a rainbow. And speaking of which, can we make the rainbow the rainbow again? What is the rainbow children to you? Does the rainbow children have to be gay? See, that's what happened. You push too hard the wrong way. And again, this is, and this is why I'm telling you, you better send your little gay, fruity, whatever warriors, whoever they be, you better send them somewhere else because I'm not you. Don't try to jade on me, will me, diddy me, or whatever, because if I have, you better be glad it's Sagittarius season. Woo! Squirrel like a pig! No! <laughs> Maybe because it's called talent. See, that's the difference when you have real talent and you don't have to suck on somebody's ish to show off your sh That means hell the queen. <laughs> this is it. Isn't that what Kenny Loggins said? Yeah, I didn't know I was going to go this long today. I really had no idea I was going to do this. By the way, people like, don't promise me something that you're going to do and then don't do it and expect me to keep waiting for you. I figured that out a long time ago when, you know, you were supposed to buy my car and it took you three years until I sold it to somebody. Else. Oh, I was going to do that if you had to done it. You would have done it. And that's the same thing like, you know, with the, uh, what? well, let's just say, if you tell me you're going to do something, I'm going to give you a certain amount of time, okay? But no one's going to get fixed one one way or the other, but you keep f***ing with me, and you're going to be the one to find out and f around, and you're going to be the one that's fixing it, see, why, because it's either you fix it, or you go to jail, or the hell, it doesn't really matter to me, because she be talking some real ish, I don't know, why don't you talk to the witch across the street, the one that ended up being face down on the floor, <laughs> See what happens when you mess with me? I'm a witch. And so, <laughs> man, so many people come up to me and like, did you know so-and-so is a witch? Did you know so-and-so is a witch? Did you know Beyonce's mother is a witch? Did you know Beyonce? And so, have you read those Charles Waddell Chestnut books? Oh, I forgot you can't read. Well, we doggy. So, well, that was Jed Clampett, if you didn't know. Yeah, the Beverly Hills business. Yeah, that's what happened. You got a whole, whole bunch of people that went to Beverly Hills and went to Florida, and you had trash that goes, you know, somewhere, and they and they thought they were rich. Here's the deal. Do you know how the real pioneers got rich? I don't think you do, but I really study history unlike you. You study YouTube. That's the history. You Or you study YouTube and vloggers and stuff. I still think that the Kardashians are part ownership of YouTube. I don't know. I mean, maybe not. You know, I could be wrong, but it's kind of that same song and now they're courting me why are you courting me because you got all these little boring ass bummy crummy bitches 
of all addiction <laughs> to a boy that's to be boring and they all want to come and do something to me we need to get that energy this is really what you do that sex energy and that and that pedo energy is a thing for you i like i can't i cannot i cannot stay deep in that rabbit hole i can't stay deep in that rabbit hole and that's when mom and dad you know came out and that's what uh, 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 uh. we just want you to see why because you know what you good at that. You could slay everybody. If you really wanted to be that rap goddess, you could there's not a there's not a person in the rap industry that could touch you if you took it seriously. That's why my mommy used to say, like, when I get back to Kathy McMillan and uh and, and my and, and Miss Howard, Coach Howard at uh, at the Olympics, like oh. But your friend went to the Olympics. That was my friend. I didn't, my, my coach, and I miss how, coach, how, I love coach how, but I was mad that I was kind of mad at her and I really wasn't mad. I got to, oh, this flies on the inside. I got to get this. I, I'm going to have, I'm going to have to burn a fly today. That's okay. Oh, you on the, you're on the inside. That's okay. Pray fly, pray. Because you're, you're a big fly too. It's a monitoring spirit. Is that what you're trying to do? You're trying to monitor me? Yeah, but let me get back to the Duke Progress energy thing. Is there anybody else that goes through anxiety when the Duke Progress, when the energy, when your energy comes on? It's like, wait, I got my energy pushed all the way down. I mean, I got my thermostat pushed all the way down because that's the best thing in the world. One thing I know, girl be paying her light bill. <laughs> I'll never get that broke again. I bet you that. I will pay my phone bill. I will pay my light bill. Oh, you know what? I want, okay. Dear Santa, five months free rent. That's what I want. I think that's the least they can know instead of lying about all this. They know what I'm talking about. They know who I'm talking to. You know what? You wanted to run a scam on me. Now I'm going to scam and I'm going to scam the scum right off of you. Don't ever think you could come up to me, big buff bully bitch beta, whatever you be, and think you're going to bully me. You don't know nothing about me. Ask some of these gang members, gang leaders, or whatever they are when they came around me. Oh, she's kind of serious with that energy. She's like, she's she's Gloria in real life. Like the movie Gloria, the old Gloria, not the one that, not the new Hollywood. Screw the new Hollywood. Screw the new money. That's the way you went wrong. The new money. I'm going to write a book about that. <laughs> oh, you going to stop that? I don't think you are, but I'm going to stop you. I'm going to stop you from playing my energy the way you do. You know what? The thing about it is everywhere I ever, Twilight Zone, we're having a Twilight Zone episode. I had no idea I was going to do that. That's because when you go out there and when you go out there and you're going to get your walk on you're going to be all at peace so you're getting it out the way okay carry on see it's a little women okay you see brilliance and then you're inspired to be brilliant you see because there's you have margaret o'brien you had june allison you had uh you had I, like africa oh that's margaret o'brien like cause i've seen i that's another movie I did, there's another video I did that. Did I put that video? I think that's another video. I don't know. I've done so, I have done so much content and that's why YouTube, will, well, come on, we can help you. No, why, why are you going to help me? You, they'll tell you, here's, here's the problem. Let me tell. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. They think they know. Don't tell them nothing. Let it go. Go ahead. I just am not signing any contracts with YouTube. I don't care about being monetized, especially by any of you. You new money motherfuckers. That's why I like to learn and learn and study the real ones. Unlike you, you study the hoes. You study the thugs. You study the ones that have no love. It's all about money. They poke their butts up in the air like they don't care. And they think it's funny. <laughs> little giggly pop people. Little toy soldier people. Little Ohio wannabes. What was those checks coming in from Ohio? You know, if you ask me, thank God for Truest Bay and the people who know me. That's the thing about me. I make personal relationships with my money. That's just me. I don't have strange banks in different places that I don't know about. You know what I mean? I don't have banks overseas and here and there. I mean, I can talk to my bankers, literally. They see, they know my face. So if you come in with some fraud type of IDs, they're going to know you're lying and they're going to call the police. You will be erased. Oh. All my bankers know me. Oh, I have more than one. Oh, she ain't got no money. What, what, I, I, Okay. Maybe I don't have, maybe I don't have as much money as you do, but actuality, do you have all that much money that you do? Ooh, wow. When these LLCs fall apart, you know what? The 
<clears throat> the best or the worst thing, worst thing that could have ever happened to you was Trump. I uh, I have I actually at this state of game I have no flags in this fight. I mean I do but I don't right because you know what my people we don't give a damn what you do. We're ready for all of you. If you get it, you get it. If you don't, you don't. You see it all over the place. And we know you could, but you won't change. Only God can judge me. Only God can judge my soul. God, first off, you have no soul. You have no heart. And God is judging you. You're clearly not smart. You really thought that you could run up on God's daughter and God would not tear you apart. Do you know my father? Do you know my mother? And you better get that bitch. I said what I said. Yo, am I going to be taken off now? I don't care. Mark Zuckerberg, are you and Elon and everybody in this too? You know what? This whole cryptocurrency thing, now we're going to have we're going to have a resurgence of that. That's what we're going to do. Like the whole thing about all the shots, shots and more shots. I've been telling you that from like my my mother's uh uh Medical book is always around me, somewhere around. My mother was a real nurse, but hey, do you? I had real uh, people. I had real stuff. And the funny thing is the people that stopped talking to me for whatever reason, the people that literally turned their backs for whatever reason, the people that wanted to smile on my face, who has that much money and that much time? Who scared my doctor away? Because, you know, Val Jones be picking Val Jones be chilling and Val Jones be picking on they got mad because I didn't pick them. Why should I pick you when I saw that all you wanted was a quick in and out, up and down, in and out. That's what you do. That's what you learned how to raise up on the energy. That's what you want the world to come to. These people out at Fort Bragg and Fort Liberty and Fort Bennett and all the forts all over the world are racing. it. They've got real girls in their family, real children that they actually love. And so, unlike some of you mofos that you actually go into competition with your children. You know, let me say this. I'm not saying that everything is perfect in the military. Clearly it's not. Clearly it's not. I told you it's just like money. You know, you give money to a thought. The money doesn't make the thought better. The money just makes a, a you know, a thought with money. They still got thoughtish attitudes. They still sleeping around doing everything they do. They still, they still a grimy little bitch that they always used to be and always will too. That is just the energy. That is just the seed. The seed really doesn't fall far from the tree. For that, for that fruit to change up, you really got some work and some shadow work to do. And it's clear most of you don't do shadow work. You don't even do you. That's why you got to always hang around other people like, you know, you want to hide yourself amongst a crowd. While me, I'm just sitting there and standing by myself, just living out loud. And that bothers you. How dare she have, how dare I have what? I love my life. I love me. I love my hair. I'm what's up. And you're what's down. Like the leaves that keep falling down from the ground. Somebody told you pride goes before the fall. And it did. And it does. And it's down. Your pride is not my pride. <sighs> the Leo energy would say, and the thing about it is the good Leos, the high vibing Leo energy. Oh, you know that. I mean, my dad every day. Of course, you know, I've got a picture of my dad, by the way. Well, she is just stuck in a program. Okay, so moat that be. But this man trained all of you people. He was fifth calf. Why don't you read up about fifth calf's history? So you got a dark skinned man that was in fifth calf. Just how Bad was we'll he? So you think some of these little beta bully bully bitches gonna come and try to force themselves on me? It was God that told me to pull out because God made me and knew I am the type of person that once I know what I know, I have to keep myself in isolation and go out walking by myself and just write and get it out of my system, yo, because I am the type of person that once I know what I know, I know how to be cordial like my mom and smile in your face while in the back of my mind, I'm thinking, how, why, why shouldn't I kill this person today? I mean, seriously. <laughs> See, she's crazy. Now, if I was crazy, I would already killed you. But, you know, that means I go to jail or to hell. And that's not what I'm supposed to do. I have a mission. That's why I could never leave here. Oh, my God. I have tried to leave this place so many times. Leave and come back. Leave and come back. Leave and come back. Why do I keep coming back to here? My parents didn't even want me to stay here. But I think they knew why. Because, you know, when you think about it, real parents who love you wouldn't want you to be, I mean, well, Man, the 
That story is so true. If you know, you know. That's sad when you're parents to, well, when you know what your child is going to go through, but you, you, you don't want that for them because you know what you had to go through. Man, there is no one in the world ever, 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 ever who will be God or goddess in my eyes other than my mom and my dad. They never lied. They pushed me. They loved me. They groomed me, okay? Not these Hollywood lies. When I said I wanted to be a model, my mom took me to see Mahogany and looked at me. Still want to be a model? No. When I said I wanted to you know, be the radio announcer. She said no right after back because I was in the Sly Stone era, Sly Stone Pisces. And look how, look what they did to Sly, all of that. Sly was a pimp too, by the way. But, you know, and then I did say, you know, I pimp, but I do, I do pimp potential. I don't pimp that way though. I mean, people look like really like, you know, want to pimp you, but see, there's different levels to this pimping game. I'm not a bad pimp. I would be a good pimp. And pimping your energy, pimping your potential, I mean, I would help to promote you in a way that, you know, I could put you on game and I could promote you you know, properly, but these people literally are trying to have a monopoly off of you, and they are in some sl sex slave, slavery type of stuff, I mean, people still into that slavery game, they really are, and here's the thing, when you come around me, and you think I'm a slave, oh, bitch, <laughs> now, now some of them say, I'm like Harriet T, I'm like Harriet Tubman, I don't think you is, and it's that too, you don't even do proper English, I mean, English is a bastardized language anyway, so let's be real, when you say everybody speak English, okay, even English is not English, okay, English is a little bit of French, a little bit of Latin, a little bit of everything. So let us be honest about what we say and what we sing. Okay. In this great country, let's make this country great again. But when was it great? I mean, let's let's do a timeline on that, okay? Can we have some real conversations, by the way? Because if you don't want to have some real conversations, you want to carry on with these fake conversations, we going to bring the old times back again. No. No. But there's some old things that need to be back uh, again, like morality. Morality and integrity should have never went away. All the lies and the BS and uh, the uh, the people that were the labeling that people were doing on people, you know, that needed to go away. Even in the Hollywood industry, the new money, you went wrong some kind of way. Your greed is always greed, jealousy, and sin. Greed, jealousy, and sin. That's where the hatred and the death begins. Greed, jealousy, and sin. Somebody said, let us make man. Let's go back to the beginning. That That's actually where it didn't begin. Because there was another beginning before that. Who is us when you're talking about let us make man? Pause. Let us make man. Pause. Let us make man. That's in your Genesis on the first line. Or second or third, I don't know. It changes all the time because you change it, but that's still there. Let us make man. Who's us? Who who else was there? Who are you talking to? It's your disrespect against women and natural people, real natural people. That will be the death of you. You're literally trying to write, rewrite natural history and natural indigenous legacy history and history right out of the books have it another look make it seem like you're the king and you're the queen and everything come from you you want to make everything about you and everything bow down to you and that includes the sun and the earth too oh honey do you actually think that the real sun and the real mother earth is going to bow to man or mankind of any persuasion? That's how the devil got himself in a hellish situation. I wanted to be all about me. And daddy and mommy went. Woo, woo, woo. And so you thought, well, I know what I can do. I'm going to hurt their daughter. But their daughter. It's just like her mom and her dad. 
maybe God told me to get out of this energy because when I go bad, it's really breaking bad. Like I am the type that go and knock on your door. Locked and loaded. Ask anybody that knows me in reality. Ask the ones who are really truthful about me in reality. Is Val Jones kidding? Like, I was kidding when I was lying about killing a couple of program directors at Fox 299, wasn't I? Was I, though? Like, when I quit right on the right on the spot and emailed to everybody. I'm very efficient, yo, because I know how people can lie. Well, she stole something. She took something. No, you know, you know what you did. You know what you did. You know what you did. If I have to suck somebody's ish to move up when I'm really good at my stuff and you make money off of me, what kind of slavery are we trying to do here? Hollywood industry, all your movies are going to continue to suck? Wicked is jacked up. Ariana, Ariana Grande and the other chick, whatever you were, you know, everybody's got to be identified as queer and bi and gay. That's where you're effed up, okay? What if everybody doesn't want to identify that way? Can we make the rainbow the rainbow again? Screw that, let's make America America again. I'm not on that time. I'm on, let's make the rainbow the rainbow again. Can we bring the real rainbow children? I know, I've, I've got the pen. <laughs> my best friend is my pen too. And <laughs> if you know what you know, moving on, because it's not about you, it's about me. But uh, see my pen, pen and had uh, I am valjones.com, but somebody stole my website and put a whole bunch of porn on it. So I got, you know, that's why I said all these people, all these hack, all these hackers, all these, you know what? Technology, that's the funny thing about AI. Where'd you get your AI from? What type of AI is it? Is it artificial intelligence? Is it alien intelligence? Uh, why don't you ask Cat Williamson and Erica Badu about aliens? Do they know about that? Let's see which one of those. Erica Badu, Cat Williamson, me. Let's see which one is telling the truth and which one is lying through their teeth. Hey, TED Talk. You want to talk to me? No, you want to talk to Lizzo because Lizzo goes with all these other foes. All of you are foes to me. Oh, you want to play on my top? My top said, let's go. <laughs> <laughs> Bitch, you didn't know. I could be talking to my top every week. Woo! Do you know why I be reality? <laughs> People, you might want to lawyer up. I can go to Jack for free. Thank you, hubby. The best hubby in the world. Had to deal with a whole bunch of generational curses, but you know what? He gave me the greatest gift. I could be a military brat for the rest of my life, and whoop, there it is. I don't have to be nobody's wife, and I'm not going to be nobody's husband. Somebody wants me to make their work wife work husband. I mean, the same thing. Like, how is that? I'm supposed to take care of you, big bully, bossy, beta, bully, butt, drunk, slut. Token whatever wants me to take it. Uh, and yeah, you want to be the man because you can lay that pipe. Well, I can lay some pipe on you. Oh, my God. What, 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 what? I'm going to do myself. What, 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 what? Going up, mother sis. That's enough. Mommy says it's Sagittarius season. We're going to be pretty. It's a pretty sleigh. Beyonce can't do it this way. No, no, hate on you, girl. Do you? How many, how many Grammy nominations did you buy? I hope it works for you. Where is Beyonce and JC right now? Everybody wants to New York me. Everybody wants to diddy me. Like I'm supposed to see New York and like I'm supposed to go what? I chose not to go to New York. Everybody said, you could be like Wendy Williams. That's all I got. We came up, me, Wendy Williams, and Vinnie Brown, all at the same time. The white Tom Joyner. You know, that timeline. Do your research, Raleigh. Speaking of which, you know, the, the most sinful city. There we go. I didn't finish that. The most sinful cities in the in, in the USA. Uh, I know you know Fayetteville. <laughs> right up the bat. And Spring Lake, you're right there with, with, with Fayetteville. But I'm just saying, love, we put it on Fayetteville. Because Spring Lake is, yeah. And by the way, on, on a real deal, not hating it just is what it is. But for real, if you're just coming here and if you're wondering, do I smell weed every time I go down Brack Boulevard? Yes, you do. That's weed all over Spring Lake. Spring Lake smells like weed. It really does. And if you don't know what that smell is, then, you know, <laughs> I 
thinking a lot of <laughs> but you know do you but that that is the smell of we why i don't know i don't care that is I, that you know i have no problem with people as long as they stay out of my hair but it's when people try to like force something on me have you ever have you ever talked to anybody who in reality knows me for more than a minute or two I mean, in reality, not someone who found me on social media or follow my YouTubes or, or whatever it be. Uh, but have you ever talked, really talked to anybody? Did they tell you the truth that knew me for like a couple of years or more <laughs> about Val Jones, about the real me, about what happens when you try to force me into something that thoroughly goes against my morality and my integrity? She will kill that energy easily play we have seen her come up to the mic because everybody out with a smile and they just walk away <laughs> who would god want a low level drinking you wake up drink i don't need nobody that wakes up drinking that wakes up smoking no you already know i mean maybe you don't but i do i can do the math but i'm brilliant are you if you're waking up drinking every day then clearly you're not because you have problems honey <laughs> your liver and your kidney's gonna go pop. <laughs> <coughs> mommy said i know you where you get ready to go with this nope stop mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. don't tell them nothing don't tell them nothing. drink 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 and more drink Smoke, smoke, and more smoke. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. I'm not standing in the way that you totally commit suicide. It's the eyes, right? Why my eye? Why 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 are my eyes looking all shiny and glassy? Is it a coffee? No, maybe it's maybe it's the actualization that the spirit, Holy Spirit, come. Oh wow, it's a Sunday sermon. Who knew? Holy Spirit is coming through, but you don't know what you see. She must be possessed with the devil. Then according to you, the devil I might be. Because you know what? The devil to the devil would be. Yeshua or Issa or someone in that high-ranking family. They had no children. A lot of people didn't have a lot of things, but they lie about it constantly. Are you a good Templar or are you a bad Templar? I guess we'll see. The Gnosis is woke. Don't play with me. Or do. I'm smiling, Mommy. Mommy says be nice. But let's see if she'll be nice to you. These planets are changing. The Earth is spinning faster. That's the truth. We're headed somewhere. Where? I don't know. But there is a major black hole. Oh, are we still having the second moon? Is that what they call it? The second moon? <laughs> or the asteroid? Or, like, I'm, did you ever see the movie? Uh, not the cartoon with the balloon. But, uh, look up. Anyway, never mind. Too much. <laughs> I know. And this is where, I know. 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 I would though, wouldn't I? I would though. Uh, but no. Well, okay. Well, um, mm, just keep doing what you do. I'm having other com her. I'm having a whole conversation. Yeah, yeah. Just keep, you know. <sighs> That's it. That's just let me know. I'm, I'm like, I'm that kid though. You know, there is a legacy. There are a lot of people talk about legacies, but there is a legacy. You know, truth when you. That's the one thing about truth. Truth is always and forever, and that is the truth. There is a constant. There is, there is at least one, it might be more, but I know, at least in my life, there is at least one constant right. And the thing about it is, I know what I saw. I know, I know what I saw. 
None every all these people can fake up, they can fake lie, say whatever they want to, make ish up, and I don't care. I mean, when are you gonna write your book? Oh, okay, and there we go. Like, which gets back to uh, Kathy McMillan and why because I don't always apply myself, I don't always apply myself because I'm a Pisces, so I like the journey. Sometimes it's not the destination, it's the journey for me. I just like. Mm -hmm. So I have so many things going on in my head at the same time, and then people want to come in me. And they want to get that energy, and then they want to take that. They want to take that energy or take my stories, and then they want to try to raise up the industry like that. But most of the ones who raise up the industry, you can get the Grammys and all this and all that. But how did you get it? That's a fact. I guarantee you, they did some strange things for cash, and because I don't do some strange things for cash, all the radio stations, just about all the radio stations I ever worked for, I was hit upon like that. See, and that's the deal. You know, when a person says no, they don't want to deal with you. I mean, a lot of these people are preachers or claim to be. Preachers. So notice how I, every time somebody get somebody's a hardcore criminal and they come out of prison and then they become a preacher. Ask yourself why does that happen? Ask yourself why these hardcore gang banger. I used to be a gang banger. I used to be this. I and I found the Lord. Oh, I used to be a hoe. I was the worst hoe in the neighborhood. I sucked off this, 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 that, and I found the Lord. And the Lord took all of that out of me. Now, can we have a donation and pay a tithe? No, sincerely, no. Sincerely, no. Sincerely, no. And it's just like the military, too. I'm telling you, if you got hardcore criminal thugged out, no morale people that come and join something, That's that they're not going to ne necessarily make a better you. It's just going to bring that energy out of you. But what they will do, if they feel like you're a liability, because we're in some crazy, crazy, crazy times, and we don't have time to deal with these types. Listen, we're about productivity. It's about productivity. I am a progressed Taurus. I might be a Pisces, but I'm a progressed Taurus. That's why that crypto do you. Do you? Where's your money at for all that cryptocurrency, by the way? Where are your NFTs at, by the way? Somebody took somebody's money and they made a mistake because they rolled up against the wrong ones. You know, you really want to believe people and you really want to believe what they say. But here's the deal. When you mess with the mob or the mafia that way, they come and get their money. I owe nobody. I owe no mob and I owe no mafia. But this is what I know. They got daughters and sisters and mothers, they love. Can you spell the word love, people? Do you know what love is? Love and lust are two different things. You all are talking about lust in everything. You got way too many preachers, way too many so-called teachers, way too many gurus, you know, on DMT, on this, on that, with the whole mushroom thing. I mean, I love my FX CBD mushrooms. Works for me. But see, even in that, I bet everything. I can't take all these chemicals in me. These chemicals are not good. Where is the food? The FDA is the big... Okay, I probably shouldn't mention the FDA because, yeah, between the FDA and the pharmaceutical company, you're the biggest drug dealers I know. But hey, do you. I'm not standing in the way of you doing what you do. You want to kill off everybody and, and it's only left a few? Go ahead. But this is what you won't do. When I have the ability to tell my truth and I say, well, I don't want to I don't want to eat this food because of that, because it doesn't work for me. I don't want to take this shot because of that, because it doesn't work for me. If I show why I don't want to do something and it doesn't work for me, and then I show you when I do something, why it didn't work for me, and then you want to come to me like I'm lying when I'm telling the truth, so you want to take off my head, you really want to kill the truth workers. You really, really do. You really want to kill the real light workers, so that's what you do. You put 50,000 clones, and we're all light workers. We're all the collective. We're all rising we rise together no you rise on your own you go in that ground by yourself you go to the scales of my op by yourself when you cross the burning sands you may cross with the group but you go by yourself and that's the truth i might have had sorority sisters that were in the line with me but i carried myself over the burning sands g b I didn't have a whole group or whole legs. I didn't even know that my mom was an AKA until after I got, until after I played Zeta. I didn't even realize. And yet I had Zeta all over my window because my, my favorite cousin, my big, who really would have been a big, who was an Aquarius, by the way. So if her energy is coming back to help me, by the way, oh, and my mid heaven is in Aquarius. There's a lot of Aquariuses that think that they got a lock on everything. You don't. 
This is the dawning of the age of Aquarius. But what happens when your Aquarius is are effed up? They are like the, you know, the pinky in the brain. They think they're the brain, but really sometimes it's pinky who's the real brain. Because the brain was effed up. The brain went insane with his genius. There was no genius because they think geniuses. That's why, you know, they need they need these little side thoughts. And then they want to make it seem like every woman's a thought. And then they want to make real women feel like they want us to feel less of us because we don't want to be a thought. So because I don't have 50,000 kids and there's something wrong with me, I didn't want to have 50,000 kids. Can you imagine if I had a child? People went after my, my ex-friends. I can't say they're my friends. Uh, so you clearly showed me that you weren't friends. So I'm good with that. I mean, like, honestly, I don't have a problem with anybody that left me. Stay over there. Stay with them. Do you? I don't want none of these people ever around me. But the thing about it is this is what I'm not going to do because you know what? They call it cuffing season or harvesting season. But this is, I'm good by myself. I've gone through some of the harshest times. I don't even remotely look at a relationship until springtime. I get spring fever, but, you know, fall time and winter time, like, well, it's Christmas time. Don't you want to link up? I want to link up with nobody but my bed and my food and my coffee. I'm good. That's what's up. And the few people that I might hang uh, hang out with, and we all on that same ish. It's like, okay, when it gets starting to get dark, we go in. We those kids. Because we don't have time to play with some of you. The freaks come out at night. They really do. I don't do clubs, been there, done that. I don't do concerts anymore, been there, done that. I don't do ter- terrestrial radio, the radio stations. I've had all their jobs before. That's a fact. I took all their jobs. That hoe did not put her in my house when her husband kicked her out. Her husband. <laughs> two people. Two people. <laughs> not one, but two people. Didn't I, get, didn't I house you and your kids a couple of times? I mean, that's real life. Oh, how did it? But you found heaven too. How's that heaven working for you? I mean, it's a fact that people do what they do. How could you be so stupid? How, how could I be so stupid? Because I actually believe these people were friends to me. I actually believe that I was like, you know, dealing with matching energy, but they couldn't understand my genius. They couldn't understand my bridge. They couldn't understand why I did not fall catered to the same story that they fall. They could. They really don't like smart people around here. They don't. They don't want the real history either. That's what me and Stan were talking about yesterday at Wally World. It's true. Now listen, and I'm gonna say this: He's got he's he's on a whole other thing with you know the president thing, but that's all right. I mean, I get I I get where he's coming from. I really do. I mean, you know, people who you know, I mean, you know, I um I you know what? Uh, okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna put that on Patreon. I will be putting that on Patreon today. Today, today, today. I've been saying it for like, you know, Pisces, we got our own time. I've been saying it for a week. But today, 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 I will, tonight, by the night, why Kamala lost. It's not that Trump won, Kamala lost. I learned that's a scary times. But you know what? I'm fine. Why? You see, uh, because we have lots of wars going on. It's bad when you have wars all over the world. But the biggest war is you have right in your own country over some bullshit. Military's not up for it. The the industry, the music industry, Hollywood industry, the Kardashians, whoever it be, you might you might have bought some little simple people that want to be famous. Everybody just want to be famous. They want to be on TV. I've never wanted to be on TV. Like I said, my mom took me to. I said something about that. I didn't finish that, and then she took me to see Lady Sings the Blues. Still want to be an actress, you know, first a model, you know, and it's like took me to see the mahogany. Then she want to be an actress, took me to see Lady Sing the Blues. See, I thank you, Diana Ross, for all the stuff that you do, and you did some stuff, too. Ooh, <laughs> The story about the Supremes. By the way, did you know that uh, Gladys Knight was the one who actually found Michael Jackson? Not Diana Ross, but that's a whole other thing. You people don't read, you don't do industry, you wait for social media to tell it to you, and then you get these little YouTube bots and stuff like that. Like I said, the Card- I, I love it how they say the Cardassians. You don't mess with the Cardassians. You don't mess with them. They're from the old country, bitch. I'm from the oldest country. <laughs> and now, <laughs> you get all over YouTube. She's a witch! <laughs> You're talking about me? Are you talking about me? You ain't afraid of this bitch, but you know who afraid of She's a witch! Y'all said you were a witch! I mean, like... Oh, only you! 
you can mirror energies like I can. I'm water. I reflect. I'm like the earth. I told you one time before, you throw some stuff at the earth, we throw it back in your face. <laughs> Reality is like that. Catch a case and you will you will catch many cases. <laughs> is going to be the best season for comedy ever <laughs> ever all the real comedians rise up because there will always be more than enough of fuel for what we do and see what I do is different from all of you like I'm like <laughs> and y'all don't do it I'm like, I'm like I'm can I shoot them down too? Try to get like slim pick. It's like, bomb them. <laughs> bomb them all. No. Mommy thought I'd be a good soldier. Daddy said, no. No. <laughs> no. 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 <laughs> no. 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 Number one, I don't want have. I don't want my daughter to have to go through that. That. That ish because I would have to kill everybody. <laughs> I would have to kill everybody on all these bases. Because, uh, you know, my, my daughter's not going through that. You, you you roll up against the wrong one with her. She's got a lot of me in her. She is she is serious about her ish. <laughs> I mean, what she said, she knows the difference between defenders. As the people at Guns Plus, I was like, you never shot before? No, never. Never. I never did. Not, to, not that I can remember. Not that I call. I mean, I had this thing against guns I didn't like. But, um... But no, but at the same time, I mean, I'm about protecting myself, though. You never know what I'm packing. That's the funny thing is I am the packing. I am the bullet. I'm the bomb. I'm the secret weapon all of me. You don't know what you see when you get me. But somebody does protecting Area 53. Well, that's a real story. Wow. How am I still on? By the way, somebody loves me. Go ahead, Val. You didn't do it. The Ranger, 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 Ranger show. I didn't do any music, yo, because now everybody's music seems to be like either owned by Belarus. What is the deal with Belarus? Hmm. What exactly is our connection with Belarus and Ukraine? Hmm, you know what? And I did. She go tapping again. Lecrae, why don't you write a song about that? Coco, Jones. You know, these are some of the people that I used to, uh, like, literally just play their music on. I mean, in the beginning, like, Lecrae wasn't there. Lecrae just came a little bit later on with the Will Smith troop. <laughs> the Will Smith crew. Oh. <laughs> Willie Boy, mad at me. His whole family is, why are you mad at me? Was I supposed to be a J-Lo? Did Jada get mad and jealous of me? Bitch, you shouldn't have wrote the book. You was the audacity. You had the nerve to put that book. I mean, you know, I was going to let it go. Let me tell you something. I can be a petty foe. I was trying to let it go. This is a real story, yo. Follow the timeline. Follow the timeline. And let me ask yourself. People do band camp Fridays and this and that. And they put out money, music on Mondays or, or, or Saturdays or weekends. Stuff like that. A random Tuesday, October 17th. A random Tuesday. Totally random Tuesday. Nobody puts out anything on Tuesday unless you're like, nobody, nobody. And come on, Virgos are supposed to know because they're very calculating with what they do. Trust me. Ask, ask me how I know because I dated a Virgo for a quick moment. I don't know and I don't care where you are, Kennedy. Don't come around me. No. In, 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 in. I heard that our rest development is going to be here for New Year's. Good. Go ahead and do you. I won't be. You don't get that energy from me. No, and I don't care about the lighting up of the Christmas tree because I have to go to Fairville at night to see you like. No, because Fairville is in the list of the cities that have the biggest sin. Fairville, Charlotte, you in that too. You were before Fairville. Yeah, you. Charlotte wants to be Little Atlanta. They're not. But why would you anybody want to be Little Atlanta? I mean, do you know Atlanta's not all? Atlanta is not. I remember how everybody used to think that Atlanta's the black mecca. It's not. Atlanta is one of the most fakiest fakiest, fakiest people, places I know. I went there and I said, my daddy would either be so proud of me or say, I, I don't know this girl. Cause I cussed out the SCLC and the NAACP cause I thought they were full of shit. Sincerely. Let me give credit where credit's due since we're coming up around friends giving, people giving, Thanksgiving, whatever you want to call it. Uh, but Reverend Hosea Williams, Reverend Hosea Williams, Reverend Hosea Williams, Martin Luther King's right hand man, was the one who started giving out food, giving out turkeys to homeless people way back in the day. Reverend Hosea Williams 
was painted uh, by a lot of elite in the um what you call it the um I don't even know what to call them the um I don't know what you call it civil rights movement I mean as I it was hard for me to like put uh, because it's like it it stopped being about civil rights and it started being about something else but um yeah and I am tapping again oh. I hate fake people. I hate fake people who, who ride on black lives. That's what I said. All you Nazis, you white Nazis, you gay Nazis, you fruity Nazis, you black Nazis. All you Nazis who want to ride on somebody else's pain for gain. I am bound and born and determined to drive you insane creatively. Like you wanted to drive me, use up my, me for energy. You better go into that integrity. That Integratron again. How does she know about that? How wouldn't I know about that? I don't need to go in there. You only have so many times I've heard. Then you run out of time. Be be scared. Be scared. But anyway, I uh, I I cussed all of them out right down Auburn Avenue. Auburn Avenue. I learned so much from Auburn Avenue. I learned so much from, and they had a mayor too that was from North Carolina. The mayor was from North Carolina, and he he went to jail. I told you. You know what? Um, Freak Nick, you if you were there, you know the real story. If you weren't there, then you will believe the lies. But they set these kids up, and these were college kids too. You want to set up the black college kids, but the white college kids can do what they need. They can do whatever they do. See, you do really paint a really bad racist picture, and you push that for views. I want you to push yourself in my face, in my face, in reality, and see what I do. See if I'm scared of you. I'm only five foot three, but dynamite is a small thing too. You know what I mean? I'm like my daddy and my mommy. I will destroy all of you creatively. So anyway, so I went there and I cussed them all out because you know what they? Because my husband and I sat there in Reverend Jose Williams' office and cried, saying we wish. Uh, he's he said I, we heard him say out of his own mouth. I wish I had known they weren't serious. Do you know who his granddaughter is? Find out who the iconic Reverend Hosea Williams' granddaughter is. And find out how she chooses. And I'm not hating on you, chick. I'm not hating on you. I mean, some people say legacy ain't done shit for me. Okay. But I'm not going to be that. And I think that is the problem. No, I know that's the problem. That they literally want to force me to be gay, bi, try, whatever it be. They want to force me into these entanglements or either catch me in a room, give me something. The next thing I know, I'm butt up in the air. And then they want to like, you know, well, we're, 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 we're going to, uh, we're going to blackmail you with these pictures. If you got some pictures of me, I own up to my ish. I'm good being me. I own up to all of my ish. I will admit it. I fell for a love mom scam. But now I'm looking at you in your face. Three words. Defamation. Extortion. Four words. Federal crimes. Defamation, extortion, federal crimes. You can still do time for that. The best of the Jewish lawyers, the best of the Italian lawyers, stand by. Lilith and Capricorn, I got my daddy mojo back, but I'm like my mommy. We're not going to go into lack because I don't have the mental lack and I don't have the integrity lack. But I have the ability to fight back when you try to put me in a lesser class. I could have blown all y'all asses back a long time ago, but I'm trying to be good. But right now, I'm in that attitude, that military brat, that military mode. Like, I wish a bitch would. So please know, whatever you do, red, blue, liberal, whoever you be, because we getting ready to go into a truly historic and iconic time in our history and our history. 
and it don't matter to me. Because I'm going to be fine. How do I know? Because once again, whatever that energy was, pulled me out right on time. Right on time, right on time, as the brothers Johnson would say. You don't like my music, then go ahead and lose it. It's okay because I'm doing just me. I'm not bringing anybody in my energy during this fall and this winter time. I got bills to pay. I can only afford to feed me, but I'm okay. Some people can't afford to feed them. They got to go to other people to eat. I will always have food. That's a great thing about watching Naked and Afraid. I know I got to like strap up a little bit with my cash and I got to like, you know, pull myself back because I do love to eat. But, you know, I can afford to get fat because, you know, what? let's let's, let's be real. I thought gluttony was uh, gluttony was a sin and cleanliness is next to godliness. Okay, then right off the bat, I see two sins that's been broken. Your preachers are fat and they stink or your leaders, or your teachers, or whatever it be. And there's a stank that, you know, there's a certain stank that you can't, you can't even wash that stank off. No matter what type of soap, native or whatever it be, you can have all the, you can have all, I mean, don't be like France. Like, you know, you know what happened with the Black Plague in France and everything, where the whole perfume thing got up because people were smelling so bad that they tried to, like, use perfume and everything to cover up the fat and they didn't wash and stuff like that. Like, some people don't like to wash. I have to wash. I was washing when my water, my hot water heat was out, and I was washing in cold weather. That's how much cleanliness is to me. I'm embedded with that energy and that legacy. I have to be clean. So why would I bring somebody unclean to me? Because that's the thing. Well, you know, we can just do it. We can just play like we can just pretend. No, there's no pretending because you didn't pretend with my money and somebody didn't pretend with what you do. You know, what? when I started to realize, OK, you some of you guys, you went the wrong way. You really do that stuff in your sleep. OK, you really do that spiritual thing, that that really bad spiritual. You went way out of bounds. You would see it's the hand, like it's the hand, it's the hand, it's the hand, it's the hand of God. It's the yard daughter. That's another thing. What did I see that? other day the yard daughter it was it was no i think it had margaret o'brien in it, okay it was that it was that it was something that's i knew and it was right at sagittarius season two. Oh my god it was other what was that movie and it was like godfather number two three four but it was it was not it was not godfather but it was a movie like that but it was a female i mean i was like and mommy said yeah, that's you why would my mother show me these things if it, if it wasn't true? Well, remember when I told you she showed me Momo with John Houston? You still haven't watched that? That's on YouTube. Why? I dare you. This is my dare to all of you. Go and watch. Go to YouTube instead of watching all these crusty little rusty little, you know, so-called, you know, whatever they do. You know, I'm I'm not them. And to to the few of you who are really really cool and going on, because I told you YouTube like you know could have been a opening, but then you know that got bought up too. Well, people got to, people do a lot of strange things for money. It's sad when uh you don't realize that you are the money. That's what a real billionaire would do. They know they're the money. They know how to make it because they know it's in them. The money didn't make them. They made the money. See, that's the difference. Ah, there we go. The money didn't make them. They made the money. That's the difference. The money didn't make them. You got all these fakes that they got this money. They had mummy and daddy's money. Where did mummy and daddy get their money from? Did they get it from their parents or their grandparents or whatever? I mean, like, let's be real. Did Trump actually, has Trump really actually made money or did he, has he made scammy money? Don't come for me. You can love Trump or dislike Trump. I don't care. It doesn't matter to me. I have no flag in this fight with whether you love him or you hate him. I'm just saying it is what it is and going to be what it be. And if you think he's going to change Fort Liberty back to Fort Bragg, then you are as stupid as you can be. Because why would you waste money on money that was already wasted? Biden sucks. Trump sucks. They all sucks. If you ask me, and some do, we don't care about none of you. We're just getting ready for us because we know who do we trust? Us. Who is us? It's not you. If you have to ask and you really don't know, it's not you. I'm being reminded every day, every single solitary day. I am beloved by my crew and I love them the same way. I really do. I am like, so this smile is real. I'm not missing anyone. We're not the Hollywood. We are the stories. We are the leaders. We are the pioneers that Hollywood makes the stories about. We are the original ones. And you think you're going to bleed us out of our integrity and our money? And we won't turn this whole world around. 
<laughs> well, your leader says we have our own leader, okay? <laughs> I'm not me. I mean, I don't mean it that way, but never mind. Create your own calm. I'm looking at it right in front of me. Oh, this bell. What time you are? I'm good. Why do I have this? We are well. You got it, the eagle, girl. You got it on. Why is sure? Why is sure? My God, you're still in August with this calendar. You about to be in December. Where are we at? We are, uh, what is this? Where are we? What day is this? What is, this is the, uh, what, what day is this? It's, uh, this is the third quarter of the USA. It's the 20, it's the 24th. What is today? November 24th. So November, you know, it's 11, 2 and 4. 2 and 4 is 6, 7, 8. <laughs> Let's get the math. Hold up. Wait a minute. She's doing foul math again. What? Child. <laughs> Her mind. The mind. Well, I'm supposed to have a mind of an interior mood. I'm supposed to be like giggly pop, drinking and sucking and looking at you. I don't want no drunk around me. I don't want no, I don't want no dope act around me. I don't want nobody like, you know what? You put that gun in my face. I swear to God, I'm going to put 12, I'm going to put 11 of those gold dots in you just because. That was, what was, no, that was it. That was a movie. That was a movie. No, 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 no. Was that the movie Expedition thing that I saw? Yeah, it was. I think I'm, I think I'm putting that on YouTube now. That, uh, where they went, no, 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 that was something else. Because Expedition, where they went into the, uh, Sane Asylum, I'm not going to do that. There's anything I will not do. I mean, you know, I, I'm not really a ghost chaser. Ghost chase me. I don't chase ghosts, but, you know, like that be what it be. But no, what was it? It was the, the God, that was it. It was the, find out, <laughs> find out about the Godmother. That's what Mommy did. Oh, my God. How am I just watching this and this came out? Find out about the Godmother of Naples. Yeah. Because they were talking about, because, okay, what it was, was it's two different things. Because they're talking about Vlad, which is horrible. Vlad. Vlad. Why would you have a name like Vlad? <sighs> sus, sus, more sus. But no, Vlad the Impaler, Dracula. Anyway, the story, of, oh, God, the real story, oh, man, that, you, oh, you people, you people that have that energy in you, I mean, you know, you got that, like, I mean, you know, I'd be the, I'm, I really would be the hanging judge. I would be just judge straight to the cows come home. I'm like, you know, kill these bitches. I'm like, no, they, they, you cannot be, they, they, they cannot be redeemed. Only God can judge me. God is judging you. God sees your entire life and not life. Like, no, but that's why, you know, like, you know, I had to be pulled out because it's like, no, 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 because, you know, she's, she's got that energy, like, you know, just off. Off, off, off. Like, why are, they, why are they important? They have to go through the process for other people. Other people have to see what you see. So that is their purpose to, unfortunately, wreak havoc. So people can wake up. to Because you can tell them. You did tell them. You did show them. You have loved these people and showed them so much care and love. And you, get, you literally spoon-fed them into their wealth. And they gave you up for the devil. The devil is your energy. The devil is your greed and your jealousy. That's where the sin begins. Your greed and your jealousy. You will do anything for money and you want to make more money than everybody else. Where did the black elite go wrong and where did the white elite go wrong? Greed and jealousy equals sin. Because you wanted, there was never enough money. Yet there was enough money. And then you became jealous or and or you became jealous of someone who you thought lived a better life than you. Not even knowing what they go through. Not even knowing what they had to go through. Not even knowing what they do. There are people who are jealous of me and I live in a little trailer park just doing me. I mean, you stole houses from me. I've had my own kin steal houses from me. Land too. I've had people who will come up in your face and smile at you and they know that they are doing you wrong and i don't know why they don't think that i i mean i have i did that when i was five years old and my cousin was six i got disrespected and i slapped the chick and she was nice i apologize for that because i was wrong but i'm only five years old but to that degree that's how strong my integrity is when i feel like you want to lie and continue to lie in my face it takes like the hand of god to keep me from either slapping or killing a bitch. God kept me from killing that program director. God has kept me from killing at least two program directors. That's no lie. 
So I'm a good kid, right? What if she snaps one day and God, God is always going to be around me. That is, and that is where my visions would come in and they play out constantly. Like, you know, you are always going to have that. You're always going to have, when you walk that walk, you are always going to have the right ones come for you at the right time. I've had, I've been, I have been times, there have been times I've been on my walk, whether it be out on Fort Bragg or out on Carver's Creek or even at the beach. And I'm like, you know, going through one of those moments. And uh, I don't care. It might be that. It may, maybe it's them. I mean, it's intelligence. It's intelligence. You know what I mean? And it's always those woo moments. You're okay. Just let it go. I mean, we know. We know. Just let it go. You know. We know. So I thank you. Whoever it was that put all these people on me, who put all these eyes on me, thank you. You actually did me a service. So instead of, you know, like me having to like convince people or get on a, a, a court of law and say all this. They see all they need to see. They've come and talked to me personally. See, if you've talked to me personally, then you should know. If you haven't talked to me personally, then you've been played by, you've been played for the, for, for your dough by the hoe. Ooh, wow. There's so many people who have uh, lost their money. They lost their houses and they're living in their cars. I'm very grateful. My little, my little TARDIS is fine. And you know, slumlords are not aside. Your business can go belly up and it will because she messed up. Anybody who like really rubs me the wrong way, they end up paying. Every place I've ever worked at, every place I've ever been, the minute that I left or pulled my energy out, bum, 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 every single time. That's when the real devil came in and their own BS came and slapped them way behind. That's why people die or people go to jail or people go to hell. And I have to take my heart out of it, okay? Because you know what? I can't look at it like I felt. I try to let people know. And then they played me for the door of the host. So if you see them die right in front of you, you just got to keep on walking and let it go. That's not on you. So I have to really be military mind like you know see you all are playing Fortnite. by the way if i was playing i don't do Fortnite, but if i was playing Fortnite, i would be what's the word classified as unreal that's what i heard you know what that is more than me <laughs> do you though so uh but yeah but yeah but yeah but yeah but yeah find out about so vlad the impaler that was horrible you people there are some people who are horrible they have that horrible energy like that i see no redemption of those you have to deal with them you have to uh, you have to deal with that the way you need to deal with that. You have to. But on the other side, they said, had that been a woman, you know, would have been her. Okay, no. But here's the deal. The uh, the the godmother of Naples. This happened for real. So it was these two mobs. These 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 two competing mobs. I told you, jealousy, greed, and, and sin. You know, it always leads to like, I want what they want. I want what they got. You know, you can't be happy with them. You can't be happy with what you got. I want, I want, I want. The greed, the greed. You want, you got enough, but you want what they have because you're jealous. See, that, that's what ate you up. Your jealousy ate you up. And so that's why little Willie boy, you know, like who, who wants to stick his little Willie. And now you got your children all messed up too. And the little chick be trying to steal everything I do. That was the thing I didn't say. Yeah, so when you wrote a book on my husband's birthday, on my husband's birthday, it's like you slapped me in the face with that ish. And I'm like, okay, now I'm going to have to go and kill a bitch. Because you went, you you did that on purpose. You did, and I know you did on purpose. And I know you may have been able to get away with that from generations, but bitch, you had never claimed across me. That's what you didn't know. That was going to be the lesson for you, slug. Let it go. Let it go. But you didn't let it go. So now everybody's supposed to look all green and bald head and bi, queer, trans, whatever. You did too much. We're still here. Straight, blackish, whitish, brilliant people, whoever I be, I'm still here repping me. You don't rep me. You don't rep me. You don't rep me. You don't rep me. And I don't sleep with anybody that I don't want to sleep to. Don't force me to do stuff that I don't want to do when you mess with my integrity because then you will really Pull the devil out on me. I might be the devil to the devil. And I'm proud to be. Pause. And bars. I didn't do the math. 8, 8. Yeah. 11, 24. 8. 20, 24. 8. 8 plus 8 is 16. 1 plus 6 is what? What's my spiritual path? What happened to the master? The one who was an 11, you know, 11 master and 22 master. And you disappeared too. What's that? Did they get you too? Did they get your family too? That's okay. One thing you were right about. You'll be okay. You're right. I am more than okay. I am a-okay. Ask yourself, who would you protect, by the way? A Kim Kardashian? A Nicki Minaj? A Jada or Will Smith? 
or someone like me? Who actually brings about more intelligence, real intelligence, and real integrity, and real morals? Who would you want your daughters to look up to in reality? Make sense of it. Make sense of it. Make sense of it. I have a lot of mob and mafia watching me. Make sense of it. I'm good for money. I'm good for truth. I'm good, period, at everything I do. I won't steal your cash. I won't steal your stash. And I can help build you up. And I can entertain you. So you want to mess up the good thing? That's not what a smart person would do. Ooh, there's the bomb right there, the smart bomb. It's intelligence. Only made for few. So, the godmother of Naples. <laughs> so, you had these rival mobs. And one of them shot her husband. Right off the bat, I can relate. Because my husband was murdered nearly in front of my face. It has taken me from 2007 to now. The PTSD doesn't go away. I mean, I I drove past where he used to work at on Bragg uh, the other day, and I started, you know, I was having a good time, too, and I just drove past there, and I just started crying. I had to pull off to the side. It sits with you. Anybody that says, you know, you, you just get over it, then they either never loved their person, never cared, or uh, they've never known that type of love, period, or they never know you. Or they're a part of the, you know, crazy kids say, well, I think she, how could I do that? Why would I, why would I have my own husband killed? Do you know how much I went through with that man trying to save him? He was better. And, I, and again, I will say he was the best thing that ever came out of that whole entire family. And they literally hated that. It's you people who can't do better. So you don't want anybody else in your family to do better. That's why I'm glad. I'm a only child military brat. I have, I may have some older sister. So I mean, my dad sowed his seeds before my mom, but I, mm -mm. none of these people. I don't none of these people, and I don't want to know them. Maybe that was one thing my mom and my aunts were right about. You don't want to know these people. <laughs> I mean, I didn't know, about, I didn't know about any of them until after my dad died. And I think my dad wanted to tell me, but my my mom and my aunt said, "Nah." And now I can see why, because I can see what cousins and friends and kin do. So you know, people, especially if you're on a rise and they're not you, and they feel like, well, they can get something out of you. So I don't know none of these people. So any of these people, I'm her cousin, I'm her sister. I'm none of these people know nothing. I have no ties. The only ties I have to are the people that I'm meeting and I have fun with and I choose to bring you on this walk. There are a whole bunch of people that I used to know that I, you know, they could fall in front of my face and I'll just walk all of them and let them go. I am, I'm there. She's a Pisces. How could she like, you know, she's supposed to always feel, I do feel something. I feel like a bitch played me and needs to be dealt with. <laughs> I feel my daddy. I feel that like real line of Judah energy coming out. Like I'm going to need to sleep. <laughs> and my mother going, no, we don't do that. Let's, 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 let's set the killer down for a second and get back to the healer mode where the world needs healing right now. First heal yourself. Yo. Yeah. So they will see it through you. They will see through all these real stories that you've been through because you're not making a story up. You have absolutely nobody writing your script. All this is coming straight from you. And you are the trip. You are the natural trip. You don't need the drugs or the DMT. Hey, Mark Marcel, how you doing, by the way, with your legacy? Wow, I just brought that name out of nowhere, right? Did I? Did I know? <laughs> you Baltimore hoes. You all the same to me. Everybody's from Baltimore. It's not a hub, but if you are, you are. Listen, I mean, I was a cult fan, so I don't have. I don't. It's not like I have a problem with Baltimore. I just have a problem with Baltimore hoes, <laughs> or they have a problem with me. But anyway, though, the Godfather, and, and and then they go crazy to the dark side, and so they really do. So I take it serious that you would want my life. I really, I take it seriously. Like you would literally have me killed. You would literally try to find some goons. Like you might be a college girl. I got goons, and I will. You don't think I do? <laughs> I don't think I have goose and goblin. Do y'all know me? <laughs> I'm not the one I'll 
blacked out and hiding with the, with the horns up of my head. I'm doing me. You can play soldier all you want to, but guess what? In reality, are these soldiers going to be protecting you and listening to you? Or are they going to listen to me? I mean, I can, I can go to Jack every day. Who says I don't? Okay. How do you know that the top is not the top? You don't play on my top and you don't play on me. That's what my top said. <laughs> Woo! Keep flying over me, boys. I love you. I really do. I love it when I go through those skates and they all smile and everything. It's just, they're just, just as sexy. I mean, I just, it's something about those parades. It's just, it's just a thing. It's, a, it's just, it makes me happy, okay? It may, I don't care if it doesn't make you happy. The military is not for everybody. And man, y'all got some, some of y'all are soft. I remember that time when I was just like doing, just doing laps. And I'm in, old. Oh, I'm in my 60s and stuff like that. And they're like, how long you been in? I haven't been in. My parents were in. I've never been, but I was literally laughing. Lapping the people, I was lap, I was lapping the new recruits. Isn't that sad when you got a sixty-year-old woman, sixty-plus-year-old woman that can do better than you? That means was it you or me? But no, back to the uh, the guy. Wow, how long have I been on today? I got to go and get something to eat. Wait, I ate a banana and I ate some pecans, and I'm drinking some coffee. So I'm good to go. But uh, yeah, uh, am I talking at the speed of light? I feel like I am. But uh, the godmother of Naples. Okay, so this mob killed her husband. I don't know if they were at, I don't know where they were, but he, he shot and killed her husband right in front of her. This is the point I'm, I'm, I'm getting. So, this is stuff you can't make up. So, in turn, because you know, there's a certain integrity like, okay, I mean, that black Sicilian thing is a thing with me. It is. I mean, I, you've heard me say that a couple of times, by the way. I, it just resonates with me. It does. It just does. It just does. It just does. Marry the black Sicilian. You mess with the wrong family. You mess with the wrong. Who was it? And then I said, oh, ooh. oh, so she's Catholic. You know, she was raised up Catholic and she's queer by and all this. Okay. It's the people. It's the stories. It's the stories that people want to play in your face. Why do you look like you're dying of AIDS, though, okay? I'm not saying you are. I'm just saying, I don't care. I just said that, though, but you look incredibly thin. So are you are you thin on purpose that way? Or are you thin because of, like, and everybody has alopecia, apparently. I don't know. I, I, but, you know, I didn't. I didn't. So I was supposed to shave my hair off like Doja Cat or whatever because somebody's having a problem. No. No. The problem was when you wrote that book on my husband's birthday and really tried to slap me in my face face with your lies i should really take a where is bubbles bubbles my fashionista doll okay hellish bubbles getting back to the godmother well it's my anger management doll key and pill can have anger management uh comedy why come i can't have anger management doll? it's comedy it's edutainment how do you like it you like my reality show it's a real reality show isn't it so much better than the Kardashian show oh we should help Kendall. Why, why, why come none of those hoes can't act? Oh, that's why you have to suck and do what you do because you're so flat in every way. And, and, and by the way, I do think she um, partly owns uh, uh, YouTube. That's why you'll never, I will never sign a contract with you. I heard you pay your people in skims or sex <laughs> or nothing. Is that true? No, but uh, back to the godmother of Naples. So anyway, so she, this rival mob shot her husband for whatever reason. I don't know. I think it was, I, I don't even think it had to go down. I didn't really process all the story but i don't even think it had to go down that way i just think it somehow or another it just went all the way wrong and they decided to shoot the man for like it didn't even have to go down that way so she went okay bottom line she caught him at dinner and she shot him 29 times it was the numbers for me Reminding you we're in the matrix. So it's a numbers game. So there's always a synchronicity for me. The numbers, the numbers. Because when was I born? February 29th. So I know when the numbers are just right. I know when it's a message for me because the numbers add up. See, Ooh, and it came right at the start of Sagittarius season two. Oh my God. My mother said, gee, and these bitches want to play on my top. You don't want to play on my mother. Okay. You're going to have some of the worst winters, whether it be hot or cold. That you've ever had in your day. I'm going to be fine. I'm like putting up the good energy mom. 
Mommy, I'm on your side, mommy. Please, like, you know, be good for me. That's why I know the people want to mess with the mess with my house and lie in my face. Trust me, that energy is going to come up at you. You're going to be in need. I'm going to be fine. Betcha, betcha. How will Kevin Hart say? Bet, 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 bet. I'm not running off somewhere, you know, because I, I, I because I got some bad checks to try to push some bad checks. Cryptocurrency, that money coming in, bet it won't. That Medicare Advantage going to pay all your bills, bet it won't. You still got the NFT, you still waiting on the NFTs to come through. And I'm like, that's just clip art. How are you supposed to make money off of that? But some of y'all wanted to believe so bad. No, but bet, let's get back. I got to get this fly because this fly is on my, is it outside or inside? But it's just standing right there. Maybe it might be a drone. I don't care. But anyway, though, so she, uh, 29, she pumped him 29 shots. And here's the thing, as they said on the TV, and she had to reload. And she's around a whole bunch of mafia people. I'm reminding you, this is the ride. One. This is the rival. This is the one who shot her husband. She came up in there by herself. <laughs> she came up in there by her. That is so <laughs> she, I mean, I respect that energy. She came up in there and pumped 29 slugs in this <laughs> I told you I have a twisted type of humor or or something. I don't know. I have a twisted type of energy because I can respect could you respect me? I could, cause he killed her husband for nothing for green Chelsea or whatever. And you know, it's a PTSD, PTSD. That, that's why I keep telling these people want to play in my face. They don't know that today might be the day I turn into the godmother of Naples. You never know. That's why when the plays come through, and they're like, "No, you won't." <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> but I could though. No. Mm. No, she pumped 29 <laughs> She pumped pow, 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 29 times. These people watched her do it and they backed up. They went, oh, hell no. We out. We out. We out. We not. We not. We not in it. Our name is Bennett. We're not in it. We got nothing to do with that because she's focus she is laced to focus so yeah she didn't go to jail but she eventually got off <laughs> or something i don't know i, I think she she didn't uh i don't know what i don't know what happened. you just find out about it i'm not gonna be a spoiler but if and she said and it was worth it i get it <laughs> i know it was i know it was so that was mommy's way of saying okay see Get that energy out. This is what you wanted. This is what you want to, but this is what you want to do. So we're gonna let you we're gonna let you see it and we're gonna let you feel it because you know you're a feeler. You have that energy. Feel it and just go ahead and get it out of you. See, don't you feel better? I do. I do. But some people need to realize that I'm like just a half a step from that life, right? They wanna play on my top. Keep playing on my face. Okay. Keep playing with me. Keep playing with me. Oh, why should I be worried about Trump or Biden? Listen, I got through the Biden years like you know, and I'm still walking out of Congress Creek. I told you your health is your wealth. Honestly, like I said, you do what you choose to do. I chose what I need to do with me, and I prove that every day. I realize when you prove your truth, people literally want to kill you. I'm like, that is crazy to me. I am actually just living my honest to God truth with integrity, with real integrity, with real truth and real love. And because of that, you want to kill me because I am living a truthful life and you can't control it or make money off of it or monopolize off of it because I won't suck the fee the D or the T, you want to control me if you cannot make money off of me. Then I start to go into the godmother of Naples, the black Sicilian era in my mind, and say, I should slay everybody 29 times. Do the math. Ah, 1124 is 8. 2024 is 8. <laughs> Eight plus eight is seven. It's a seven day. It's a Sunday sermon and vows therapy talk. Twenty nine times. Find out about the Godmother of Naples, by the way. <laughs> That's a real story. I know I'm tabbing.
it. Do a do a song about that, Lecrae. <laughs> what about you, Coco Jones? Everybody sing these little sad songs. They got messed up. See, you know what y'all were wrong. Fam, will you bring Soul School Cat? Soul School Cafe is always back. My own way, but will I help any of these people in the past? Nah. I really feel bad because I was really like rocking with Nicolay. I don't like foreign exchange. But, um. Hmm. Your music brought me great joy. But, you know, Robinson County and Durham. And Durham definitely was in one of the cities, of, by the way, the most sinful cities. Fayetteville, Charlotte. Charlotte was before Fayetteville. I mean, Charlotte was like number 77. Uh, and we're talking about in the whole entire United States of America, by the way, the most sinful cities in the whole. Uh, and I think Charlotte was number seven. So now people want, why do you never want to move to Charlotte? No. Charlotte's always, Charlotte and Wilmington reminded me they have that great energy. Just like wannabe cities. Uh, like I said, Charlotte wants to be little Atlanta, but it's too country bumpkinish. I mean, you know, people who, people think that they're deep, but they're not that deep. Now they're mad at me, but I mean, you really do. You think you're that deep, but you're really not that deep. I mean, you're really not that deep. You could be. You got the potential, but you're not that deep. And you got that North Carolina. North Carolina has a lot of jealousy in it. A lot of jealousy and greed. See, I told you, jealousy, greed, sin. Boom, there you go. One of the most sinful cities in a... United States. Well, it fits, show. Charlotte's right there. Then Fayetteville's 100 or something like that. And I mean, you know, if you've been in Fayetteville, if you've been here, you know what I know. I can remember when times were better. I'm not going to say that, uh, uh, you know what, military brat, you always had a melting pot. We had better days. We had real clubs. We had real clubs. We didn't have hole in the walls. We had real clubs. We had, remember the Skyliner room that rotated and stuff like that? You know, we didn't have to deal with the market house in any way. I mean, many times they try to get me to do some stuff and make the market house. They remember when they wanted to have the farmer's market there, and I'm like, I'm not doing that. And they're going to try to force me to do the commercial. It's the stuff that you tried to do, knowing that you were lying to me. Or maybe you just expected me to be little missy. Little, little miss. I have never been kissy. I am not the slave. Bitch want to bitch wanna treat me as a slave. You know what? But you at that Carver's Creek and McDermott. I don't know McDermott's, okay? I'm I'm in my I'm in my James Stillman Rockefeller era. And I'm telling you, one of the best things he ever did was got that local off his farm <laughs> and he raised up his ish you know he and his wife you had a legacy plus legacy because she had her own money too she came from money so you got money plus money see that's the problem with some of you you don't have money but you want to be around somebody with money you want to link up with somebody with money or you want to lie and flex like you have money but you don't money comes from the mind you know what billionaires do the real the first made billionaires do they had the money came from them. It came from within. It wasn't what the money did for them. It's what they did. You know what? You don't get it. I can't teach any of you. I'm doing this all over again. It's just like with the MLK. Like look at the MLK statue and stuff like that. Does that even look like MLK to you? And why do you put MLK Avenue on the most blighted cities and the most blighted streets in all of the cities? That's an insult to me. But you really know. And it's that too. You know what? Because before MLK, there was uh, what was it, Reverend Johns, Jones, Reverend Johns, or something like that in Alabama. Who, who was actually MLK before MLK. You know what? It's all, you know what? You so, oh, God almighty. I said my daddy would either love me or hated me when I when I literally cussed out all the civil rights league. They hated me. They hated me. Reverend Orange and Reverend Jill Lowry and stuff like that. We just say, hey, why did you hate me? I was a good kid with a good cause, but I realized you were all about the fraud. Like I said, Reverend Hosea Williams that man, yeah, he, yeah, he was a preacher, yeah, he drank, but can you understand, if I had to be around these people, and they were that fake, oh, wait, I have been around all these people, and they are that fake, they will cause you to drink, they will cause you to do drugs, they will cause you to do a lot of strange things for change, but what they didn't do was get me to kill myself, smoke a fentanyl joint, try to wipe myself out, because you couldn't get your thing in where you wanted to, oh, my God, I should kill you all right now, Mommy says, remember the godmothers of Naples. Get it all out. 
who y'all need to find out what was that was watched i think it was in one of those uh because you know i watched uh it was um it was uh one of those uh marvels the the not the mark but it's one of those marvels you know the the the, the same channel that's got the expedition all this i mean i watch different stuff than you do you watch pookie in the hood stuff if that works for you but that stuff's never worked for me no we have different energies and so it's the people who have the low that's what i call low mentality because that's the stuff you are you are what you eat you are what you consume i watch a different thing and that's why people but you're supposed to focus on me like these are the same men who like if they get a smart woman in their life they think that she's supposed to have her legs spread wide open and just make babies and just cook all this brilliance and brain and intelligence and i'm just supposed to spread my legs and drop your dirty rotten crusty ass seed and be proud oh yes my man that was never going to be the life for me you are always going to be competing with me. I compete with no one. You compete with everybody. Worst off is you attempted to compete with me. Impossible. I need to go out walking. So anyway, that's all I had to say. The uh, Godmother of Naples. That's what I'm going <laughs> to. I might label this Godmother of Naples. Check that out. I don't know if I'm going to label this, but uh, it's Happy Sunday. That was Sunday sermon. Woo. Yeah, that's it. Have a good day. I've said more than I need to say. Man, I missed the I, I missed the little women. Well, come on. Thank you, TCM. By the way, thank you, TCM. I I rocks with TCM. Uh, I I rock with TCM. But I I'm not. I can do a lot of things. I can do movie reviews. I do commercials. I told you I can do. Com I still do what I always used to do at Fox ninety nine at D one hundred three at BC Broadcast. And I mean, I was the one that was writing most of those commercials and producing them too, and producing them and write for all the formats, for all the formats. I was like, I was telling, you know, which was sad, but it was true. I was telling, uh, uh, not WFNC, but it was the KML. Actually, I, I got, cause WFNC was with Cumulus, uh, but KML, uh, the best people that ever, that treated me the best, at BC Broadcast, and ironically, were the folks at at FLB and KML, Foxy and 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 Kiss. That was we were all supposed to be family, right? Do you know what it's like when you bring a station that had no ratings? The station was in non-existence, and you were the first voices, the first female voice on there, and then years down the line. You have some little funk master flex wannabe who wants to roll up in your face all gang like all gang type. And I had to remind him any monkey can run a station that's already at the top of the tree. I started that I started that scrap from scratch with my energy. Bitch, if you don't get out of my face, I will kill you and all your wannabe dreams. I'm not the one you just want to like roll up on and try to gang bang me, okay? Do you know my father? You might today. Think about it. Have a deserved day. And if you feel like I'm talking to you, I'm probably am. Bye, boo. That's it.